Hey guys, welcome to this Learn and Go video. Today I will show you how to upgrade your Windows version with the uh, Windows Anytime upgrade. Uh, first, it's not a free service. You will not be able to upgrade your Windows version for free, of course. You need to buy a, a key, you need to buy a Windows product. You can go uh, to a store near you and buy a new Windows version. Uh, and then use this key to with a Windows Anytime Upgrade or you can buy directly online your key and then upgrade your Windows version. So let's start. First to access Windows Anytime Upgrade you go to the Start menu. Maybe it's already there as you can see but you can go in All Program and it's going to be at the top right there Windows Anytime Upgrade. Click on it. You have two options. You can go online and choose a version of Windows 7 you want to buy and it's gonna bring you to a website or you, if you already have a key as I said you can use a normal key if you buy a, a box at the store you can use this key or you can get the key online with the first option so you click there and you enter your key so if you buy online well just make sure you you save your key somewhere if you need it in, your f in the future when you have entered your key there will be a verification so you just need to wait when the verification is done you will have to accept uh, the license term you can read them if you want honestly I will ski skip it <laughs> and now it's saying it's time to upgrade windows so can take 10 minutes from my past experience takes around 20 minutes but may depends on your internet speed or the version and the version you you have chosen uh, maybe uh, for example windows ultimate windows 7 ultimate i think it's going to be it's going to take a lot of a little bit longer than the other version so now you just need to wait. Of course your computer will need to restart. Just make sure you don't power off the computer during the upgrade because I don't think it will be a good idea. When the upgrade is done, as you can see at the at the beginning of the video I was using Windows 7 starter. Now I have Windows 7 Professional. So if I log in everything will be changed. I uh, will get more option of course because Windows 7 Starter is a very basic version of Windows 7 mostly for netbooks and I should get a new yeah new window this upgrade was successful Windows 7 Professional close and now as you can see I have all new options and I will be able to change my wallpaper here we go so what you need to do now is activate your Windows version because it's not done yet so a way to do it is you go start menu in computer you do right click on computer then properties just go down and as you can see here, Windows activation have 30 days to activate. So you click on the link and activate Windows Online now. So you just click here, you wait, and it's going to activate your Windows version. When it's when the registration is done, well, everything is done. You have a new Windows version and it took maybe 20 minutes it's that simple so thanks for watching my video if you want more tips you can go to learnandgo.com or visit my youtube channel thanks for watching